On April 29, the inaugural Wuhan Rural Cultural Revitalization Micro Summit took place in Wuhan Changjiang New Area. This summit, jointly guided by the Wuhan Municipal Agriculture and Rural Affairs Bureau, Wuhan Municipal Bureau of Culture and Tourism, and Wuhan Municipal Science and Technology Association, was hosted by the Wuhan Rural Development Association. It was co-organized by several entities including the Yangtze Daily Rural Revitalization Communication Center, Wuhan Ziwei Cultural Tourism Group, Wuhan Shu Culture Society, Wuhan Cultural and Art Exchange Association, Wuhan Agricultural Society, and Hubei New Era Economic and Social International Exchange and Development Center. The summit's objective is to strengthen the soft power of rural culture and facilitate the coordinated growth of agriculture, culture, and tourism. This will be achieved by delving deeper into the notion of revitalizing rural regions through cultural means. This meeting brought together key figures such as Lu Lingxiao, former deputy director of the Hubei Provincial Tourism Bureau, Zhang Sheng, deputy director of the Wuhan Changjiang New Area Modern Agriculture and Rural Development Bureau, Pan Yen, secretary general of the Hubei New Era Economic and Social International Exchange and Development Center, as well as Miao Lili, the executive director of the Zhujiang Rural Promotion Association, and the general manager of Zhujiang Kunju Tourism Development Company, Limited. Alongside them were other leaders, renowned experts and scholars, and representatives from various businesses in the field of cultural revitalization, who engaged in discussions together. During the meeting, attendees engaged in thorough discussions on topics such as leveraging culture to drive rural revitalization and tapping into new quality productive forces. They also addressed potential pitfalls to avoid when developing rural cultural industries, offering novel insights and alternative approaches for revitalizing rural culture. Ultimately, participants reached a consensus on the vital role of cultural revitalization within the broader strategy for rural revitalization, as well as the promising opportunities presented by agricultural and cultural tourism. As the vice chairman unit of the Hubei Provincial New Era Economic and Social International Exchange and Development Center, Wang Mo, the editor-in-chief of Qingqiao Magazine from Qingqiao International Security Group, was also extended an invitation to participate in the event. Wang Yimou highlighted that Qingqiao Magazine serves as a cultural bridge fostering mutual understanding and favorability between Southeast Asian countries and China, bolstering people-to-people -people connections within the One Belt, One Road initiative. Its content encompasses multiculturalism, international education, business insights, and more maintaining its original goal of fostering non-governmental exchanges and cooperation. He emphasized that promoting rural areas through cultural initiatives aligns with the future trajectory of global rural integration. Qing Chiao is committed to contributing to this endeavor, aiming to construct an open and inclusive international platform for rural integration. Hubei, situated in the heart of China and part of the Yangtze River system, boasts flat terrain and a favorable climate, rendering it one of the cradles of the Chinese farming civilization. Across its developmental trajectory, rural areas and agriculture have consistently stood as pivotal components of Hubei's identity. In the 21st century, Hubei has made notable strides in revitalizing its rural areas. Data indicates that the province has maintained a stable grain output of over 25 billion kilos for numerous years, reaching 27.645 billion kilos in 2021. Additionally, its freshwater product output has ranked the nation's highest for 26 consecutive years, reaching 4.832 million tons. Furthermore, Jingchu culture, with its rich historical roots, stands as a significant wellspring of the Yangtze River civilization. Unearthing rural culture involves delving into the origins, innovations, and transmission of Jingchu culture from the fundamental realms of labor and daily life, thus unraveling the allure of rural culture. Leveraging rural narratives to propel the creative evolution and innovative progression of Chu culture not only enriches the spiritual and cultural tapestry of rural inhabitants, but also bolsters the soft power of rural culture. The summit also delved into forward-thinking deliberations regarding the cultural strategy for revitalizing rural areas in the future. Integrating rural cultural tourism into the fabric of new rural area construction emerges as a fresh concept and pathway for infusing vitality into rural areas through culture. This approach is poised to catalyze advancements in rural economy, culture, society, and ecology, among other facets. Qingqiao, bridging the business world and delivering information to you.